The Ram 7 is an absolute beam in Modern Warfare 3 to where it got banned from rank play. So I got y'all the number one Ram build that's going to help you dominate every single lobby. Ladies and gents, let me know in the comments. Do you think this gun should have got banned from rank play? I think it's a very good gun. I don't think it should have been banned in rank play because it's not like everyone was using it. And in my opinion, it wasn't really a problem. This build though is kind of a problem just because this gun has a lot of horizontal recoil. But we are going to eliminate that horizontal to where this thing is so easy to use it's going to be an absolute beam so if you do want this gun to be very easy to use you do have to go over here the cast is break if we look at the pros it's going to give us a lot of horizontal recoil control and a lot of firing aim and stability the firing aim and stability is going to make it so the gun doesn't really shake and then we are going to be losing a little bit of our mobility but it's only about six percent so you shouldn't really notice that much and you're only going to notice how much horizontal recoil control you get do you want everything in Modern Warfare 3? If so, check out Guapsi. There are a team of people who will play in your account to legitimately unlock anything, even Iridescent or that brand new Warzone nuke skin. I have been working with Guapsi for over a year and I haven't seen a single negative review. I'll have their link in the description. So now this gun isn't going to be as shaky, but as you guys can see, still is shaky. It doesn't really impact you that much, but you know, it is still a little bit hard to control. So if we go over and add the Bruin Heavy Support Grip, which if you didn't know, you actually can like favorite the attachments. We all know there's way too many attachments in the game and it's very hard to find them. So I like to like favorite certain ones and then it shows up at the, at the front of the list. So it's a little bit easier to find them. So we also get a lot of aiming idle stability. So now our iron sights really aren't going to sway that much, which is going to make it a lot easier to hit the first shot. And I got a lot of comments to my last ram video people saying yo i can't do what you're doing with the build there's a lot of recoil it's hard to hit your shots that's because you're probably missing the first shot you need to make sure you hit the first shot in the gunfight because then aim assist is going to help you and that's going to help you control the recoil therefore your gun's going to have less recoil and then we also just get overall a lot of recoil control again we are losing some of our ads speed and we're actually losing a little bit of the vertical so now the gun is going to have a little bit more vertical recoil but it's not really going to have the side to side bounce anymore and you guys can see ads speed yes it is a little bit slow but it's not too bad for an ar and that's probably like the biggest issue with the gun is that there's a little bit of like um the ads isn't the best that being said we still are going to go ahead uh, go ahead and add the hvs 3.4 pad this one's just going to add a lot of gun kick control and recoil control which remember the gun kick control is more important than the horizontal and the vertical that's going to make it so the gun really doesn't move that much yes we are losing more mobility but at least we're not losing ads speed so it doesn't really matter that much another one that i really like i believe is going to be the hvs no 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 it is the hunker 5 stock pad so the reason this one might be a little bit better at times is that if we look at the cons yes it looks like we're losing more but we're not losing sprint speed and tactical sprint speed you guys all know me i always tax sprint around the map and so this one actually makes me feel like i'm moving around slower because it lowers my sprint and my tactical sprint speed this one does not do that and so you actually can move around the map a little bit quicker with the hunker but there is going to be slightly more recoil overall though i would try both stocks and use the one that you do best with that one is heavily personal preference now from here this gun only has about 30 rounds so i like to add a magazine if i'm playing on a very tiny map like shipping or stash house usually i'll add the 60 round mag just so i don't really have to worry about reloading but in the game plays i am going to be adding the 40 round mag just because i don't want to feel like i'm too slow that is like the biggest con of this class is that you are a little bit slow but there's no recoil at all keep in mind a little bit of vertical but overall this thing is so easy to use and those iron sights are so clean now to where you don't really need an optic if i were to add one i would add like the slate reflector or the mk3 reflector overall though you don't really need it if you want to increase the damage range i'm not running this in the gameplay but if you do want to make this gun kill a little bit quicker at range and i believe this was my last ram video like my last ram build this is going to be the cronin headwind long barrel this can increase the effective damage range and so now our four shot kill is going to be up to 40 meters which is honestly very good and why this gun is actually meta in warzone if you are using this in warzone i would add the cronin headwind long barrel outside of warzone i don't think you really need it and then we are losing a little bit of our mobility which is why i'm not running it for the regular multiplayer um some people do like to add the high grain rounds to increase the overall damage range but then there's a lot of recoil in the gun so i don't really recommend that just run a barrel at that point overpressured a lot of people don't realize how good overpressured is i'm not running in the gameplay but overpressure will make it so the enemy screen shakes making it very hard for them to actually win the gunfight if you hit the first shot but one reason i don't really run them is because if you hit the first shot you're usually going to win the gunfight 
anyways. And then, um, so what I'm going to be rocking is a rear grip. I'm rocking the retort 90 grip tape. I know you don't really need it. It's just made the gun a little bit more satisfying. There is going to be a little bit more like aim and idle sway, but as you guys can see, that sight really isn't swaying that much. Now there's going to be a little bit less vertical, making the gun a little bit easier to use. And so I just noticed myself being more consistent when I did add the rear grip, but sometimes I will go over. I'll add an optic or a laser or barrel. You know, it kind of depends on however I'm feeling. Maybe I need some extra ammo, so I'll run this one. Uh, this one's actually not bad at all. I really like the recon. It's just you strafe a little bit slower. Overall, it doesn't really matter what you run. You just really want to make sure you have that muzzle, the underbarrel, and the stock. The rest is personal preference. When I'm running in the MGB gameplay, which if you want to get better, I would definitely check it out. I would say it's a pretty entertaining gameplay. Rocking the Renetti as the secondary. That thing is crazy. Infantry vest, so I can tax for a little bit longer. I always run out of ammo, so I've been running these scavenger gloves, uh, gloves recently. If I don't really need extra ammo, marksman gloves are the way to go. It just reduces sway and makes it so your screen doesn't shake when the enemy shoot at you. Cobra sneakers so they don't hear is an EOD, so don't worry about nades. Now let's get into the crazy gameplays. Yo, ladies and gents, I'm so happy right now. We got some Merc My whole team is gone. We got some Mercado. We got a blue sky. Oh, the not moving. We're gonna drop a nuke. Where are they at? I don't know. I'm lost. I need to start fragging. What the fuck? I'm the best player in the world. I know exactly where they're at. They're in middle. And they're going to be over here. Next hard point is by me. I'm going to let them push me and then we win. Boom. What? Oh, shit. No. Oh, you literally look like an ant. Huh? Relax. I am so much better. This gun is insane. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. I got to move. Okay, they, I think they actually heard me and they're all starting to press the hard point. Where are they spawning? Bro, my teammate's on X Games mode. He's tweaking. Bro, I hate when you try to lay down and then it has you stand up and then you lay down three seconds later. Like, I swear this shit logs your buttons. I'll try to lay down, it doesn't work, and then I'll be in a position where I can lay down, and then it has me lay down. Bro, this thing has no recoil, oh my god. So my last build that was very similar to this one, people are like, yo, um, you got a crony, my build doesn't do that. I'm like, well buddy, if you want your gun to be good, stop with the f***ing nades! It's like, well buddy, if you want your gun to be good. You gotta have the crony. No, I'm joking, I'm joking. You gotta hit your first shot. If you hit the first shot, then the rest of the shots are gonna be easy to hit because then you have Amos is helping you out. Okay, I do not know where... Spooky. That was horrible. That was, in, it was very embarrassing. Okay, we got them all coming through middle. No, you're going the wrong way. Oh, I know what they're doing. Because the EMP is up, they're just shooting at each other. That shit's so funny. That's so much comedy. That was funny. Okay, spawns are spawning everywhere. There is no spawns. This is not good, but it's also very good. Because we're on a 21. But what's not good is that the advanced UV is going to be gone. And then I don't know what to do from there. This guy looking at this? Okay, I'm going to be running away. I, I don't need to chill that. Oh, you know what we can do? Wait, there's a... Oh, it still works. Obviously, it still works. They just copy and pasted everything from the map. Over. Bro, I'm so ass now. Bro, okay, guys, move. Hello? Bro, I looked away. I looked at my minimap right then. Spawn die. Sp 
spawn die. 27. Bro, why are you in the one area I can't check? What are the odds of that? Enemies. Look at the scoreboard. You need the objective. Thank you. 29. That's my note. Oh my days. We dropped an MGB. We got a fucking MGB. And we got a swarm. Look at that. Yo, leave a like and subscribe. I thought I was going to get it. Chill with the fucking nades. Jesus. Switch to something else. Try out the Semitexes. Obviously, the nades aren't working. Okay, you know what? We got to We got to put them into the actual blender. We got to start pissing them off. We got to we got to play with their emotions. Bro, this thing's got no recoil. Yo, if we had a Mercado 24-7 playlist, that would be great. You know what's very tragic? The entire year last year, we never had a Mercado 24-7 playlist. I don't know if I'm fated for that, but I feel like we all wanted a Mercado 24-7 playlist. That guy's an iridescent. One shot. Nope. Okay. Swarm with the double MGB. Woo! Something's not right. I'm going to go inside. I don't like this. The oh, wait. You're in my objective? Swarms, get them. Come on, swarms. Sick them. I don't think my swarms got a single kill. Come on, swarms. Sick them. What are they doing? Swarms, do something. 20 kills for what? 20 kills to hear bees in my ear? What the fuck was that? That swarm didn't even work. Okay, I know I'm missing. I know I'm missing, but it's like one of my first games on. Ooh. Okay, we have no ammo. The game is going to end soon, and we still need like 15 kills. Hopefully my teammates stop trying. Let the enemies capture the objective. Enemies think they're about to win, and then we win. No, dude, you got to get in the point. No, I still need nine more kills. This is not good. Oh, shoot. If it's at 240, I gotta call it in. Wait, 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 wait. The enemies might be able to get the next hard point. I get kills. I call on MGB. We get a second nuke. Oh, look at that, boys. Too nasty. No! Damn it! Leave a like and subscribe. With the noties on. Code Seabass Foul Video. 20% off. Let's go! Easy nukes. Wait, we gotta get in the sun. What is happening? Why is there blood? Am I bleeding? What happened? Was that the Valvidian? Easy nukes! And nukes. Uh. We get the one down. I got a new coat of chapstick on my lips. We just knocked down 21 Savage. I'm feeling great. The enemies are feeling great right now until I strip my dominance onto them. 
Got to go absolutely crazy. No, no, no. Enemy, calm down, calm down. You should not know I was there. Oh my god, I missed every shot. But then we recovered and there's still... Are you guys making fucking babies? I'm not even going to ask questions. Okay, I might have applied a little bit too much chapstick. Motherfucker knifed me. And then he knifed the air after. Just to like, you know, really put it in the stone that he just knifed me. Okay, I need that guy to start moving and start playing the game. But once I'm like, you know, five kills off the MGB, that's when I need him to uh, go back to AFK. You know what the AFKs, I don't like them, but you can kill them very quickly. So then they, have, they keep on respawning and then they stay AFK and then it's like a constant free kill. But that's boring. Why is that guy still there? Like, what the fuck? Not once have I seen that and uh, I'm like, that's the hole I'm going. That's the place I'm going to. So this map, very easy to pop off on, but also very easy to die. So you just got to make sure you hold the angles correctly. And not like overexpose yourself when you're reloading or doing certain things. Bro, yeah, my thumbsticks, my thumbs are really oily right now. Oh my God. Okay, these guys are playing astronomically slow. That guy threw something I saw my life flash before my eyes. Oh my god. Is there a guy behind me? Oh, there he is. Bro, I am him. I am iridescence. Let's go. Maybe I'm not. Well, I'm like actually tweaking. I don't know why I'm missing so many shots. This is spooky as shit. I'm surprised they haven't spun inside me yet. Well, my teammates going insane too. Holy shit. 22. Well, look at the accuracy, though. Yeah, I'm taking nine years in between my shots. I'm a little bit slow right now. But look at that accuracy. I didn't realize he had a knife, and I meant to slide. And of course, like, when you mean to slide, your character's like, no, no, no. We, we don't slide out here. Wait, why is that guy looking away? Twenty-nine? Please give me this nuke. That's the nuke. That's the MGP. Let's fucking go, boys. Oh my god. Too nasty. Also, okay, I'm not telling you the name of my second channel. But I'm currently uploading shorts onto there. And I am, um... I haven't made them public yet. But I'm getting about 5 to 10 shorts on there that I'm happy with. I already made a few of them. Sent one of them off to a few people. Then they all kind of said the same thing. I, I, my bro, I, fuck! I hate this swarm. I might have already talked about this in my last video. But. Bro, swarm! There's no enemy there. You bitch! I've never. Whoa! There's a lot of them. I do. I'm sorry. I take that back. I don't think I'm ever gonna use them again though. So, like I was saying, making a lot of shorts on there right now, and I made a few. I did not like it really, or something was off. My buddy told me his thoughts. I was like, oh my god, that's what's wrong with it. And then I just feel like I went into a, like a new arc of content. Like on this content journey I'm on, no, the videos seem pretty basic. But I'm always doing more things behind the scene. I feel like I just went to like a new territory because I just learned so much from like, he didn't even tell me what was wrong. He just said one thing and it made me realize like why some shorts online pop off and why some don't. I'll explain in the future. If you come by a stream, I can tell you. But um, so basically making that tweak. And it is so much better. So now I'm currently trying to remake a few, re-record a few, and then gonna make about five to ten, probably five of them. Right when I make them public, that's when I'm gonna set the timer and I'm gonna try to get the channel to 100k in six months. That's the goal. The timer hasn't started. Wait, what are you doing, buddy? You have no reaction time. Has the timer hasn't started, but once I make the videos public, 
again making about five youtube shorts then making them public and from there is when i start the timer the six month one i'm gonna see how many subscribers i can get in six months in short form and i feel like i can really pop off on there but the way to really get good at something just so you guys know is actually doing it a lot of people just talk about it me sometimes but when you do it that's when you learn so i finally got around to making them well okay the long form videos were a little bit tougher to make because i'd like this channel takes a little bit of time to do and then streaming and stuff like that and uh you know gym and things like that but um okay buddy calm down the shorts are pretty easy i said i was gonna start doing the shorts on there the next day i started doing guys what the fuck happened you guys all just snorts i mean take some valvidian drink some valvidian bro that almost sounded really badly some people okay i'll make a joke some people are like okay so on stream i get blessed a lot and some people on stream are like oh what the, what are you gonna do with all this money and i'm like i'm gonna go buy a lot of hookers and cocaine and they're like really that's not good i don't know if i could su support you anymore and bro it's a joke <laughs> it's a joke i just say like the first thing that comes to mind and then after i say it, i'm like okay maybe i shouldn't say that again or maybe i should say that again that was kind of funny oh. you're literally the horrible about the game Oh, I need to do another SVA build. Because there's a new one that I don't, I haven't... Bro, Chango! This guy thinks he's so good. He thinks he's so good. Bro, this rim. So satisfying. Bro, those mosquito drones. Okay, you know what? You know what? Actually, ah, ah, fuck it, okay. I'm gonna reveal, I'm gonna reveal one of them that I'm doing. Are drones racist? <laughs> this thing, the circumference on the skin is just way too obnoxious. 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 That's a pretty obnoxious word. The, uh, the spelling on it, it's also obnoxious. This high ground is obnoxious. That's obnoxious. I didn't hit a single bull right there. That headshot was very up. Okay, sorry. Woo, that quad feed was obnoxious. Come on, SVA man. Come on. you guys see this weapon and i don't even have a barrel on it imagine if i had a barrel bro i love the new uh health regen rates so much better oh my god bro i might be able to get a nuke from just staying up here i don't know if i'll have enough time or ammo i have a singular bullet okay well, we are gonna get a kill with it though no we are not Okay, guys, I think it's time to call in the advanced UV. I was going to call in the nuke, but I just realized I have an advanced UV, so that makes the game a little bit more enjoyable. Even though the match is basically over, but we got to assert a little bit more dominance onto them. W and aid. Yeah, this is definitely the number one ram for, like, multiplayer. You don't even need a barrel on it. They hold all the objectives? Let's go! Another advanced UAV? Bro, enemies, keep on capturing every objective. Let's go. Get this shit up. Win the game so I can call in the MGB and actually win. Oh, no, we got B, damn it. Oh, EMP? Are you kidding me? Of course. We've taken Charlie? Okay, time the MGB. Time the MGB them. I hate when I wait till last second and then that happens and then I die. And then we're gonna swarm them, assert so much dominance onto them, and completely take over. Let's go, guys. That's the MGBs. Now I don't mean to be annoying. 
you guys should definitely hit the subscribe button if you enjoy the content and leave a like we're on our way to why did you run away we're on our way to um a lot of subscribers 109 kills that's disgusting it's kind of crazy